All right, so I, I let the, the city run so we can make some money here. And we're making a decent amount of money, 30, um, yeah, 35K now. Still trying to hit up to like around 50K. I'm hoping to hit 50K, but we're given an extra feature now that we can actually uh, modify the terrain, which is kind of cool because that's what you expect from any city building game. You have to modify the terrain eventually. I want to avoid using this, but we'll use it later. So now we have a massive demand for industrial, um, what you call it? industrial factories, factories or any industrial type of stuff. Let's see if I can actually figure this out. So originally as planned, I'm going to buy this sector here. It's only 4,400. And there we go, just like that we expanded the city. It looks like I can't buy any more, but hey. So the plan is to build industry down here. So now I have enough money to do so. Let's head back down. Can we go back down to this view? What's this? Oh, the milestone. There's the next one, Boomtown. And that's what I want, so. Can I kinda, oh yes I can. I can actually do that, but I'm not gonna do that. Let's do this. Let's create a industrial district here. composed of industrial plastics, polymers, and rubbers. We also know it, but indica that is more important than the car itself. And that's why it can also carry up to 300 kilograms of human, animal, or consumer goods car. The climate control device brings the air temperature to 22 degrees. All right, let's see if we can zone this out. Oh, actually, wait, 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 wait. I, I'm gonna need water first. Get as much coverage as possible. Increase our power output, then build. Let's change this to a bucket. Oh great, we got little holes here. I'll fix that later. In the future. Let's meet these demands. People need jobs, I give them jobs. Still haven't really meet our ultimate goal, which is to build a city that it's clean. Definitely. I got some really weird road networks here. Let's just do that. We're gonna need more fire stations. How crazy is that? Right, let's stick that there. Education. We got plenty of avail available education. Uh, yeah, we got plenty of people, plenty of capacity, but not many people are uh, are el eligible, which is not good. I don't know how to make them more eligible. I, I guess time will do my work. All right. We can put parks, make people a little bit, you know, happy about this place. Can I put a small park? No. Oh. The only thing I can put a small park. I'm required to bulldoze some buildings down here. I'm not gonna do that yet. Ah, oh, which is barely meeting the requirements here. You can expand, you can also have to expand your, your resources.
Is there any place that has coal? I I don't know. Where where does show where I don't think there's any coal. Um I know there is an information tab. There should be an information tab for these type of stuff. But that isn't the case. Or maybe because there's no coal. That might be a better point. Alright. Oh yes! We have hit the 2k mark. Might want to figure out a way to connect this road here. It's a really bad way for me to draw a road. Uh, no, I don't want to. I don't want to do that. Actually, not yet. Okay, now we can expand the residential area. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna build this guy's house down. She's. Alright. Okay. Pause for a second. Some people have to be unhappy about it, but what can I do? There's just things I have not planned out before. Alright, let's connect this main road. Take some more water lines. I need more surface area. All right, oh, those these guys' house later. <laughs> ah, yes, I am that guy. I definitely don't have blueprints when I started playing this game. I'm here to just build here. So if you're not satisfied with what I'm doing, that's okay. We can always make arrangements. Actually, I'm not ready to um, to zone this out. Let's stop it right here, and then I'm gonna hit the play button again. Do I have water? Yes, I do. Power? Probably not. Yeah, definitely not. My gosh. We, we really need some water. Not water, power. I, I want to unlock this already. Almost there. 2600. Oh, we're not meeting the requirements because the winds keeps changing. Can we do it? Produce. Come on now. The change in wind determines our power source. Unreliable. Alright, now we have power again. Isn't that just tragic? Our our main source of power depends on nature. I mean that that's that's always been the case, right? Uh, I wanna put this down already. The latest technology allows you to build advanced wind turbines. Oh, there we go. There we go. We have hit Boomtown. Ah, oh, yes. Okay. Stick it right here. Now we have a massive surge in power. We shall provide. Well, this is really cool looking. Check this out, guys. Yeah. I, I might consider building one of these things. This might be cool. Might be a cool project I would do. And look at that. The sewage has showed itself. 
Do I really need any more? Oh, yeah, that is just disgusting water. It's seeping right over here. There's a plane. Okay, let's expand. This way, this way. <sighs> look, look, look at that. Look how big you can build this. I want to buy this. But it's not much usable land. I think this is a better choice. Oh, it gets more expensive throughout time. <sighs> yeah, definitely gonna have to put a lot of time in this game because I'm not I'm not quite building to what I want. Okay. This is toast. I don't know what I'm gonna do about that. I might Alright. Wind is blowing this way. Looks like it. Is it? Let's check the wind direction. It used to tell me which way the wind blows. And I don't think that's the case anymore. But I want I really want to build houses here. But we already screwed up on this. Well, we were only given this land anyways to begin with, so you know this game screwed me over, so it's not my fault. Uh to try and maintain the fact that we try and stay clean clean as possible all right let's start making some room here I'm gonna stick this here wait actually we can stick it here also this is gonna be really weird isn't it so let's make sure we have enough power I think that's our number one goal utility Oh, what's this? The coal power plant. How nice. Alright, now we definitely have a sufficient amount of power. Twice as much as I want. Or I need. This place, this place is just getting <laughs> nuke-like pollution. I want to start pushing education so we can stop getting these type of industrial, or at least dirty industry, and now our road infrastructure is now becoming a problem. Uh, we gotta expand this road. And I don't want to do that until I hit... Uh, if I'm going to do this type of stuff, if I'm going to expand this road, we're going to do it when I have 100,000. Because that's going to be a lot of money and lo a lot of losses. I'm trying to figure out what should I do with the industrial district. We're going to move this somewhere else. Parks. Hmm. Might have to deal with that later. Medical... Stuff. Death care. Oh, we can put a cemetery. Ugh, do I put a cemetery next to a landfill? I don't know. I I don't. I honestly don't know if people want a cemetery next to the neighborhood. We're about to find out. Okay, people want a cemetery next to the neighborhood. That's crazy. I I would never buy a house next to a cemetery. I don't feel as is a good idea. But these guys are a little different, so hey, let them be. Do we have a high school now? We do have a high school, so we can actually push our education higher. Is elementary school is doing just fine? So let's speed it up. Make some money. You know what? I might... Let's see, 114 students. 112. <sighs> One school is good enough, so I'll just keep it there. Fire hazard is too high. Stick one right here. There we go. Lower down the fire hazard. Garbage is beyond belief. Let's do this.
check out our economy. We haven't quite reached this. This is the goal here. High high density stuff. Office zone. Still low income. Alright. We can have a bus. Public transportation. That's what we need, but we don't have money. To start zoning this out, anyways. I want to work my way in. Okay, let's uh, connect these roads. Space is already occupied. There we go. Nope, check the water first. We gotta put some water. It's a lot of work. I'm sure I will create something unique with this water line. So surprised that my water is still doing just fine. We have enough water. Okay. Back to zoning. Power has been my biggest enemy. There we go. What was I going to do? Crime rate remains low. Healthcare is doing just fine. Check out on the water situation. Gonna, I'm going to turn off some of these. We need to... Oh, it's raining. How nice. Can I turn off individual? No, I can't. That's something I could do in some city. You can turn off a certain plant by cutting the budget. But in this game, I think you can... You do it for all. That's a problem. And I have to adjust this. Here, yeah, I have to adjust that for night and day cycles. Pull that up. What's that? Money. I don't know what that means. Not enough customers. All right. I guess, uh, see power. I mean, we're, we're, we're operating more than we should have, so we can start destroying stuff. Still too much. Man, those, these, these wind turbines are really nice. The only restaurant with the servers are dinosaurs. Our animatronics are so real, you'll think a T-Rex is serving you T-Bone. A pterodactyl is serving you teriyaki. Alright, I guess I think you guys really want public transport. Do I have enough money for it? Do I dare? Hmm. 30,000, that's that's my entire savings. Come on now. Well... This is the Mars official radio. I'm Panem Askelin. Unbiased information is essential to proper development. Still, people find it hard to understand that skewed information corrupts their conclusions. In context of social I should move this. Like yeah, let's move that. Budget, information has to be undistorted and addressed without preconceptions. Move it here. With scientifically based information, the most difficult arguments can be settled. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. All right, now everyone's off the grid. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. No, that's not what I want. 
this one single power line will make the difference in the world. Let's connect it anyways. And the power's back on, boys. Just like that. Our one and only power line. Can you imagine a natural disaster can ruin that? These people want parks. And they keep asking for parks. Park this, park that. Okay, I give you guys a park. Hmm, okay, happy? I don't know what park I put down, but it's definitely a park. We're about to hit our highest point of salary. Almost 3k a week. Yeah, we're making a really nice amount of cash now. Can I buy more land? No, I can't. Alright, we gotta handle this treatment stuff here. Let's see water. We're we'll not unlock this. 16,000. I need water. I think it's a good time to put this down. That should beef up our total production of water. And now we need electricity to connect our water pump. And that should do the trick. This is what a water pump looks like. So make sure to be on the top and not at the bottom. Soon we might be able to have apartments. Oh, we actually do. Well, kind of. Let's take a look at these houses. Speeding things up, just choose my frame rate here. And this is the cemetery. Yes, there's only one, two, three, four, five, six, about six. Six people have died already. And here's the park. Looking good, looking good. I'm gonna expand over here later on. This probably should be. Ah, uh, residential over here, yeah, yeah, residential over there, or not, I kind of want a residential be over here, this is a really nice spot, uh, we, we will shift this place up, fire, we do have a, we do have a uh, fire station right here, so it should be able to to put out the fire. Oh, this must be the road I was looking for. Okay, speed it up. That traffic is just so bad. I really need to expand this. What road is this? I don't want to spend money on that if I can't figure out what it is. Highway. Four lane. Okay, so this is... Uh, we will figure it out. Infrastructure can be figured out by itself. That was really nice. It's raining. Well then, I think this is a really great stopping point because I think I got a stable city. We just gotta work on some more um, zoning. Put some public um, services we actually had to put it high school, huh? Where should I put this high school? Right here. Put it next to the cemetery. Why not? Kids love to look at stuff outside the window while they're in class. So, yeah, I think this is a great stopping point. 
So thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you guys next time on City Skylines.